So my time here at Utah State has been probably one of the hardest things I've ever done. People had told me that it was going to be pretty tough and I didn't understand how tough it would be until I actually got into it. I originally picked mechanical engineering because I knew it would be hard. I wanted a challenge. I spent countless hours in the lab. Just writing out code, debugging, doing homework. It takes a lot of work but, but they get to work on a lot of really cool and important things. That's what I liked about the idea. It's, it's teaching them how to analyze, to think, to resolve and it's trying to break them out of this just parrot mode to think, no, the best ideas are in your head. Dream a little. Well, you know, catch the vision of engineering. So engineering isn't just about the equations or the derivations, it's about applying that to something that's real. The majority of my, my experience that really sticks out is, is being on the Baja team. I've, I've been involved with the Baja for the last three years. We've built it ourselves. Baja gave me purpose behind the coursework. Uh, the, the classes have given us the tools that we need to be able to do the designs. I have, I've enjoyed many of the professors here. Most of them have been very willing to help us, you know, in class or even out of class, you know, especially on the Baja. I got to have undergrads take what they learned in their entire undergraduate application and apply it to something real. They started up having us do basically a top-down or a bottom-up sort of system design of a rocket. They built incredibly sophisticated rockets and launched them. It was a great experience for all of them. In the MAE department at Utah State University, there's a huge opportunity for undergraduate research. Any student can come in and be involved with research. It's pretty cool. It's exciting to, to work on some cutting edge technology. It teaches us how to communicate with a lot of different people. Through the research in Utah State University, I gained a lot of skills here. It's really challenging at first, but it allows you to, the experience you need to, to learn how to express yourself. It's been one of the toughest things I've ever done in my life, but I've enjoyed it because I've had hands-on experience. So I'm originally from Maryland. I grew up and went to high school in Maryland. I had a sweater in my basement that said Utah State on it, so I was interested in them. Then I got really excited about Utah State when I heard that they had sent more experiments into space than any other university in the world. I've been able to perform research as a as a sophomore and now as a junior, and uh, have entered many competitions, written many papers, and presented at places like Long Beach, California and Orlando, Florida, in front of hundreds of different uh, professional engineers. Dr. Ban in the MAE department has helped me through this research. I can remember many nights spending hours in his office, him helping me through the research, helping me do the analysis, and helping me write my paper. His dedication to helping me succeed in my research is really the best thing about Utah State. I'm pretty sure I heard from some other people about Utah State and all the work they did with NASA and different things like that and my mind was like, yeah, this is exactly what you want to do. So a lot of people just think engineering is about doing homework and staring at computers and sitting in a cubicle all day, but there's so much more to it. It really takes a creative mind. You know, I don't regret anything about it. It's exciting to be able to, to accomplish and to contribute something. I really like how all the professors are helpful. You get a great education from engineering. You understand a lot of different aspects of life. The MA department will prepare them for the professional world to just um, leave here with a degree that means something.